Now, your flash briefing from Channel 3 Eyewitness News, sponsored by Ion Bank, your financial services partner. Good morning. I'm Eric Parker. Let's get you caught up now on the latest coronavirus numbers in Connecticut. So far, 8,700 people in our state have tested positive. 335 people have died. About 1,400 patients are in the hospital right now. Today, we're expecting to learn more about the number of people who have recovered. The number of cases is expected to grow, and this morning, more people waited hours to get tested at the drive through site at St. Francis Hospital in Hartford. Some of these people were in line before 4 o'clock this morning. Some good news out of all this. Governor Ned Lamont says even though cases are rising, they are leveling off, and we are no longer seeing a surge. It could be a sign that social distancing has help it, helped to flatten the curve. The number of hospitalizations is pretty much what we've been describing for the last week or so, which is that it's not going up exponentially. It's going up in a linear way. We're told, though, the peak in Hartford County is still a couple of weeks away. Thousands of people are waiting to get their unemployment benefits today, and it could take a month and a half. 302,000 people have lost their jobs in Connecticut since the pandemic began. The Department of Labor is processing claims 10 times faster than normal, and they've quadrupled the number of employees working on benefit applications. But the coronavirus has caused two years worth of claims to be filed in the 30 day period. All right, today is not going to be the best day in terms of weather. By late this morning into the early afternoon, we are expecting some strong storms to roll through. The Storm Prediction Center has put us in the possible risk category for receiving these strong storms and severe weather. So please keep your eyes to the skies if they look threatening. Head indoors. We also have a wind advisory that goes into effect around 2 p.m. And it's going to get windy during the storms and after the storms with gusts to 40 to 50 miles an hour. Daytime highs today in the mid 50s. We're talking about uh, a seven day forecast that it shows improvement after the storms today. It'll clear out tonight. Tomorrow, we start off with sunshine, but clouds roll in with scattered showers, maybe even some snow showers up in northwest Connecticut with a windy day tomorrow. And then Saturday and Sunday for Easter Sunday, we're talking about some really lovely weather with partly to mostly sunny skies, 60 degrees on Sunday, increasing clouds on Sunday night. And then Monday, we're talking about heavy rain. Let's check out your early morning forecast from the west end of Hartford. Have a great day. Watch Eyewitness News for the latest updates. This is your personalized flash briefing, sponsored by Ion Bank, your financial services partner.